Hello everyone, and uh, we are back with another unboxing for the show. Actually, uh, I completely forgot about the, saying this on the weekend preview, uh, that Sonic Mania was coming out this week. And I'm actually kind of excited. This is one of the first times in a long time I've been excited for um, a Sonic game in quite some time. The only downside to the, this week is that it's SummerSlam week and everything that I'll be doing wrestling-wise, I'm hoping that I'm going to have enough time to put into this itself over here uh, in this particular game uh, in some way, shape, or form. But I did get the collector's edition, and I do plan on getting a uh, getting a good chunk of time in on this particular game. So, with that being said, we got the collector's edition of this one, and there's a good uh, and you know there's a good reason why. I, I was a big Sonic fan way back when. Obviously, Sonic had fallen let's say, out of favor with many fans over the past so many years with uh, certain bad games such as the 06 game and a slew of other games that were not necessarily so favorable uh, in any way, shape, or form uh, in, in that sense. Uh, so, with that being said, let's go ahead and get this thing going. Get this thing up and running with because, you know, Sonic Man is actually... They've shown off gameplay, they've shown off a lot of different things, and it's gotten people really, really amped up for it. And I'm hoping it lives up to that hype, and uh, obviously it's hyped me up enough to want to do this, and want to get the collector's edition. Most of the times when I have bought, bought a game in a long time, I just go with the normal edition, but I saw the collector's edition for this one, and I just had to do it, uh, in, in that sense. So let's go ahead, let's get this unboxing started for you guys. Uh, I'll pull this off camera here for you guys and I'll kind of pull it out there because honestly this box was a lot bigger than I thought it would be in any way shape or form uh, so like let me take uh, take a look at the size of this one you you guys have seen my wrestle crates in, in the past you've seen the wrestle crates in the past you see and the loot crates in the past You've seen the size of that box. It's not that big. Look at the size of this thing. It's gigantic. So, up top, we've got our everything. And, okay, it's a box inside of a box. Oh, God, it's a box inside of a box. So, let's turn this thing upside down. Is there more tape? Tell me there's not more tape. I don't think there's more tape. No, there isn't. There's not more tape. Let's just make sure that I'm opening uh, this up correctly. I think I am. As we pull this bad boy out right now. Um, well, for one, I hope that didn't show up on camera at all in, in any way. Um, it looks like it's a digital code uh, for the actual... Uh, for the actual game itself, so I'll, have, I'll be getting that one put in here very soon uh, on there. So hopefully that doesn't show up on camera. Plastic box. Okay, so first of all, here we go, Sonic Mania. An old Genesis cartridge. Gotta love that. You just gotta love that. Good old Genesis. Uh, and, and they really went with a nostalgia. In, in this collector's edition, and that's probably why I really went with it. it was because of the nostalgia factor of most of this. Um, before we pull out the figure, there's something else in here. Let's see what this is. It's a Sonic Mania. It's a card. It look, it's just. It just looks like a card. It looks like a like a metal card of some kind, in, in that sense. And uh, there it is. Uh, the, the the last portion of this is going to be really, really nice. It's looking really, really good. So, yeah. I'm not sure exactly what this is. It looks like just a metal-esque card. It has uh, Sonic on the front. Just saying Sonic Mania. And it has Miles, Tails, and Knuckles on the back. Alright, guys. So, I'm going to have to pull this off. I'm going to have to pull this box off of here to try to pull out this last portion because this is freaking cool. So, let's close that up and let's get the box back in here before I show you guys the final piece 
of everything, the piece de resistance, as they would probably say. Sonic figure. Nice Sonic figure. But even better, on an old uh, on an old variation of a Sega Genesis. Like I love the fact that they even got the on-off switch down right. The reset button. Obviously, these buttons don't really work. They're uh, in that sense. Though it is hilarious that you can't press down the reset button, but you can move the on-off switch. You can move the on-off switch here, but you cannot press the reset button. Can I move the volume? Yes, I can. You can even move the volume for the headset jack, which is actually in there. They actually have a headset jack in there. That's kind of cool uh, in that sense. This is actually a really good figure. I like it. I really do like it. Um, nice looking figure. Uh, nice looking old Genesis style to it and everything. Really good stuff. So, um, actually that was everything inside the box. Um, the, like I said, the figure was bigger than I thought it was going to be. I honestly thought this figure was going to be a lot smaller in, in some way, shape, or form. But I thought the box was going to come out a lot, uh, a lot smaller as well. You do get only a few things out of it. You don't really get um, a lot out of it. But I think at that $80 price tag, well, I think some people were able to get a little bit cheaper uh, a, few days, uh, a few days before release. But if you got it like right off the bat... Even at that, I, I actually it wasn't even eighty; it was seventy dollars. It was a seventy dollar price tag at that point. Um, that's not too bad. It is not too bad of a price point for everything that they're going for. And yeah, that figure actually looks really nice. I'm not gonna lie; I'm not. I'm not disappointed that I bought this collector's edition in any way, shape, or form. At least I'm not. I'm still very amped for this game. I can't wait to get it into. Uh, I can't wait to get the uh, code put into the PlayStation and get it downloaded. I know we've got a lot to do with wrestling this week, but I'm going to try to make every eff concerted effort to play some Sonic this week on my stream and uh, get some uh, content up here for you guys as well on the channel. So with that being said, guys, I hope you enjoyed this. That was the unboxing of the Collector's Edition for Sonic Mania, and I hope you guys have a great rest of your day.